a good afternoon. Sunday the 18th of September. Long weekend with the kids. Absolutely had such a laugh with the kids. We went to the trampoline park and everything, gravity, had a bright blast on there. And now I'm gonna do a quick overnighter on the club water. Just barred around all my gear. Yeah, I'm gonna start to get set up. Find a few spots, guess a few spawns out there. Yeah, I think it's cause we can nick one or two. Right. Spawn mix today, same as usual. A bit of scalded pellet, some whole 17 mil pellet, some chickpeas, some sweet corn, and of course squid two tea boilies, some innovat baits. Gonna whack a load of this out there now. Have a couple of spots. Both woods are out. I had a little bit of a lead about before I started even spawning anything out and I found a couple of nice clear spots in amongst the weed. This is naturally a very weedy water. There's a lot of lilies and a lot of weed. You can do really, really well on here as long as you find the clear spots in between the weed. If you don't and just cast out into the weed, you don't really have much of an opportunity but the clear spots are here, you can find them and once you do and get a bit of bait on them, you can normally have one or two fish out so I am confident of getting one or two out of this swim and this is one of the popular swims on the lake up on the point of the island I haven't fished up on the point of this island for about 15 years so it's nice to get back in here the last time I fished up in this point, up this point of the island I had the biggest fish out of the lake off the very point I'm about 15 years old with a 32 pound common. But a lot's changed down there. There's a lot of nice fish in there still. They're just under 30 pound. And there's some absolute stunners. So I'm going to get the bivy and that set up because there's been a little bit of rain. I'm very confident of a fish. It's now half seven. There's a few fish in the swim. A couple have jumped out. Didn't seem too much of a bad size, really. in that net. Go on. I've just returned that 21 pound 2 ounce common. Really long fish. Really quite wide as well but not so deep. Hard fighting. Yeah. It's always nice to get a fish from the club water on the first night back. This lake's always good to me, so... Yeah, thankful for that one. Fingers crossed we can grab another one or two during the night. Put a few spots, just put the rods out. So I'll bang a few spots back over the top again. I only had the one through the night last night. I had a 20, 
21 pound 2 ounce common it's a really really nice fish I didn't have anything else through the night I've been up since first light just keeping my eyes on the water I just scanned about to see if I can see anything moving and the only place I've seen any carp is actually over the back where I've got both of my rods at the moment so they're still bashing about in the lilies in the weed so they're still in there did have a few liners during the night but yeah just the one fish I said I got up at first light I brought both rods in clipped them both up to the spots nicked on a couple of PVA mesh bags got them back out and then I put the rest of my spot mix over the top which is about four spots over the top of each rod it's hopefully going to get us a bite at some point this morning people like that fact and they like the fact that she was and the institution is above oh, the yes. that we are all entirely deferential <laughs> it means that it's outside I was waiting for one more opportunity and he gets it. <laughs> How'd you go? Did you get one next week? Of course. Oh. Hello. 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 It is off. Yep. Very weird. It's in there. There it is. <laughs> there is one in there. <laughs> in that massive ball of weed, there is a fish. There we go. That's a common. There's definitely a fish in there. Get in there. There we go. Last fish of the session. Low little double common. Time to go home. Sorted. What a nice way to finish the session. Right, I've put that small common back. I'm about to get out of here anyway, so I'm gonna pack this rod up and do the off. But two fish from a session ain't too bad. Yeah, time to go home. Good luck and tight lines.